So every month, child support, make them payments, man. So money's a little bit tight for me. Um, I'm not broke, though. I don't want y'all to think that. The way I refer to it, though, Greg, is uh, I'm in between blessings, okay? Anybody that's your story, you're not broke, you're just in between blessings. Yeah, man. Listen, when money's tight for you, you just got to find a way to make it work, okay? Like, there's certain bills that you don't pay on time. Like, dating power and life, I never pay them on time. What for? I just wait till I get a phone call from 331-3900. <laughs> you too? Uh... <laughs> When you see that, you're like, hey, I got 48 hours, or it's about to be. <laughs> they so gracious, ain't they? Who would do that? Yeah, that's so nice of them to be considerate. Um, yeah. But money is funny, though, man. It has a way of dictating your attitude and your temperament. Like, when you have thousands in your account, and you got to go to the bank and make withdrawal, you feel good about yourself, don't you? It's a whole other area. You go in there with your chest poked out, speaking to everybody. Shirley, what's going on? What up, boy? You write little motivational quotes on the withdrawal slip. No matter what you're going through, young lady, there is light at the end of the tunnel. But when you're between blessings, it is completely different. You will fill out your draw slip in the car because you don't want nobody to see you take this $8 out of your account. <laughs> you go in the bank different. Your head is hung low. You ain't making eye contact with people. You're melancholy. <laughs> you speaking, but not. <laughs> you letting people cut the line. Hey, are y'all two together? Y'all all right? No, nah, you go ahead. Go in front of me, man. No, I need to talk to her individually. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, it's my cut to give. Come on, man, going on. Man. Act like he the supervisor of the line. 